Hey guys, it's day seven, and we're going to be studying chapter seven today. This has been an incredible journey. But where we find Jesus is, in chapter six, remember he had the real hard teaching, and most of his disciples just quit following him altogether. So now you find him having a conversation with his brothers. And verse two, it says, Then the feast of Jews, or the feast of booze, was near. Therefore his brothers said to him, Leave here, go to Judea so that your disciples may also see your works, which you're doing. For no one does anything in secret when he himself seeks to be known publicly. If you do these things, show yourself to the world. For not even his brothers were believing in him. Well, the controversial thing that can be seen here is, was this his physical brothers? Well, there's some who say because of the Greek word, it could be used as brethren. Now, that would be a hard stretch in this word, especially, because he also says his brothers. He's not saying the brethren. And not only that, this same word is the same one that's used in Matthew chapter 12 and in Mark chapter 6, where it actually names his brothers. And it says his mother and his brothers. So to think that this was anything other than Jesus's half-brothers that Mary actually had other children, anything other than that would be a, a far fetch. It doesn't take away anything from Mary that she had other children. And there's no prophecies that saying that, G, that, that Mary would remain the perpetual virgin. So there's no problem with her actually having other children and these being actually the half-brothers of Jesus. But there's another thing that seems maybe a little controversial and that is where Jesus says to his brothers, I'm not going to go with you. You guys go ahead. I will remain. And it says that he remained in Galilee. But after a time, it says, verse 10, it says, but when his brothers had gone up to the feast, then he himself also went up, not publicly, but in secret. And so what it's saying there is he remained in there in uh, Galilee for a few days. And now this feast would have lasted for a week. So probably midweek, Jesus joined in probably with the festival part of it. Now, when it says that his brothers went up to the festival and later Jesus went up, you have to remember that whenever you go to Jerusalem, it's referred to as up. No matter if you're traveling from the north or the south or east or west, you always refer to going up to Jerusalem because it was a holy city. So there wouldn't have been any controversy there. Jesus just came up probably midweek and joined in with the festival, but in secret. Now, there's a lot of things that you may look in and go, hey, I've got a, a few questions about this. When you come to that, jump into it, dive into it, research it, because God's got something he wants to show you right there. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow as we look at chapter 8.